Wow Plastics, in association with Paramount Coffee Cups, is proud to present Jacques Cousteau, Above the Ocean. Join me, the ghost of Jacques Cousteau, for a Christmas special as my crew and I explore the mysterious land above the ocean. The city above the water has so many beautiful Christmas lights. Pascal, our great diver, has been assigned by me to go inside one of these lights and bring back some toast for our Christmas meal. After carefully climbing into the apartment world, he noticed a mysterious land full of splendor for the scuba diver. He picked this apartment because a manager of a nearby Carl's Jr. thought there would be a bread inside for which to make the toast. The land of the apartment seemed foreign to Pascal. He knew that in order to survive, he would have to acclimate to a surrounding. In a great and courageous move, he took off his snorkel and his mask. Using the mental resources provided by me, he used a crowbar found in the nearby room. But this knot would be as easy as expected. Pascal was determined to gain entrance into the refrigerator. Using all of his great strength, he tried again. After a momentary rest, Pascal knew that it was time to continue his search for the great Christmas toast. Acclimating himself again to the floor and finding trouble breathing, he decided to use his snorkel apparatus again to begin comfortable scuba breathing. Laying hands upon the refrigerator, he found that there was a lever that he could easily use to open the door. Once inside, it was surprisingly easy for Pascal to find the bread. Making his way into the counter and needing to cut the bread, he found his diving knife, that trusty sharp thing. He was now one step closer to actually having the Christmas toast. Seeing that the toast was now done, he reached into the heating implement and made his way toward the counter. Here, all of his Christmas season skills learned the board Calypso paid off. The use of the butter, the spreading with the knife, these were now simple tasks for Pascal. He would soon bring his Christmas treat to the men. With his merry seasonal toast in hand, he was easily able to make his way through the apartment and out to the balcony area, where he could then return to the ocean and to the hungry men aboard the Calypso. We thank you for joining our Christmas special tale of Jacques Cousteau above the ocean. <laughs>